Hey everyone, you've asked for it, and I'm delivering. So, I've noticed in my comments that people wanted the next in the series of the Department of Transportation videos. And we originally started off with the Toyota Tacoma. I think it's time we upgrade the poor Toyota and get a Ford. This is the Ford F-250 Utility. Now, this truck is meant for helping with roadside assist, everything like that, and it is a viable asset on all fronts. It is the same dimensions as the Toyota Tacoma, but it is a slightly different build due to being different manufacturers. So, let's get into it. Now, the first materials you're going to need is polished andesite slab, polished blackstone slab. You're also going to need polished deep slate slab. You're going to need polished blackstone stairs, uh, stone button. You're also going to need oak trapdoor. You're going to need diorite wall and yellow concrete. So to start the build off, find where you want to build it. Then you want to place a temporary block and place your andesite one half slab above the ground. Polished black stone stairs and a polished black up polished andesite slab. Put two diorite wall on the sides. Those are your upright headlights. Polished black stone brick stairs with buttons, of course, for the wheels, everything. Then you're going to want to bring more polished black stone uh, slabs. And from end to end, you want a total of eight. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now you can go ahead and add this back bumper. It's the same as the front. Polished black stone brick stairs on either side, same way. Oak trap door and with the stone buttons, everything. Deep slate brick slabs, three blocks long, and that should finish your frame. Add a yellow concrete here, then three, then one, then a two by three. No, uh, one by three with one jutting out from the end. Then you want one here and one here. And that's all the yellow concrete you should need in this part. Um, next, you're going to want to grab yellow wool. You want to keep your oak trap doors. Get nether brick stairs, dark oak signs, oak signs. Uh, you want lapis lazuli, yellow or uh, oak button. I <laughs> would have said yellow button. And um, let's put in the mirrors so it's easier. Get your wither skeleton skull. So you want to place the lapis lazuli here, here, with yellow button. Uh, ah, oak buttons. <laughs> and then a, another one here. Now this is actually chevrons back here, and then this is the actual logo. So you want oak sign here. Another brick stairs here with a sign in front. That's just to make the grill. Um, we need to grab oak stairs. Uh, you can get rid of your signs. You don't need those anymore. Uh, place two temporary blocks. We're going to put in the mirrors. Wither skeleton skull on either side. Next, you're going to want to place three nether brick stairs. And that should be all your nether brick stairs now. 
then you want yellow carpet on top of the lights oak stairs you want to do that to the back too and then place a T shape of oak trapdoors plus one here and one here now replace your your uh, nether brick stairs with another brick or uh, black concrete and then you want red carpet you're also gonna want daylight sensors you're gonna want polished deep slate slabs as well as polished black stone button acacia button and you also want red sandstone wall you'll see why in a minute so first before and after the logo you want to place black stone uh polished black stone button same on both sides black concrete in a t formation daylight sensor you just keep them yellow red carpet and then yellow carpet on either side that completes your cab there deep slate brick slabs that'll create your toolbox and you want a red sandstone wall and a acacia button that's your uh, little cone and then you want a warped button you want to get item frame now you should already see my last video you know how to make this with a red banner with a white band that should be all you need to know at this point you're also going to want black carpet and I think you can actually clear off all the rest of your stuff too. I think that's everything. So, or button on either side, that's for your number on your vehicle. Item frame on either side. Uh, you got your tail lights. Make sure the white is pointing down. And then black carpet in a ring. And that should be your completed Ford F-250 utility truck. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this episode. And we will be in the next video showing you how to build these variations. Including the arrow board and the, the snow plow. If you ever have a place where you need a you have a lot of snow yeah i will definitely show you how to do this but until that time thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video like and subscribe and i'll see you guys later bye